Hello everyone. This video is in continuation of my last video. My previous video was all about the heavenly bodies, the planets and the sun. This video is about the moon and the stars. Let's talk about the moon. We all see the moon daily, right? But what is moon? Moon is a round heavenly body which is also round like a sun and it is the closest neighbor of the earth. But from the earth both sun and moon appear to be of the same size. However, the moon is much smaller than the sun. So why do they both appear to be of same size? The reason is because the moon is much closer to the earth than the sun and the things that are nearer appear to look bigger. Take an example of an aeroplane. When you see it in the sky, it appears to be of a tiny size, but actually it is very huge in size. The pictures that are taken from the space shows that there are many holes on the surface of the moon and these holes are called craters. Moon revolves around the earth in the same way earth revolves around the sun and the moon is the natural satellite of the earth. Moon does not have any light of its own. so. How do we see it light up at night? The reason that we see the moon with glow or shine is because the light of the sun is reflecting of the surface of the moon that is visible to us. In 1969, the astronauts Neil Armstrong and Edwin Aldrin were the first people to land on the moon. Interesting fact to know, first Indian to land on the moon was Rakesh Sharma, but nobody can live on the moon. Why so? Because there is no air available on the moon and we all know that air is very important for living beings to survive. Our next topic is the stars. At night, you all must have seen the stars twinkling, but do they really twinkle? Since they are very very far away from the earth's surface, they appear to be twinkling, but in reality they are not. The stars are a huge ball of gases and have their own heat and light just like the sun. The brightest star in the night sky is Sirius. Sometimes the stars appear to form patterns and these patterns look like figures of animals, people or things. These patterns are called constellations. So we can say that a constellation is a cluster of stars that create an imaginary shape. Some examples of constellation which can be seen easily are the Great Bear also known as Ursa Major, Scorpius also known as the Scorpion, Leo representing the shape of a lion, Orion also known as the Hunter. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you like it. Please do like, share and comment and do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you.